love so i have a haul here for you today i've been trying to film this for i want to say about a month i've been so terrible with trying to film this um i'm probably the worst person ever but life kind of has happened to me i've been so busy i just got a new job if you follow me on instagram you guys would know that um and i've just been so busy i haven't been able to film this these products literally have been sitting in my room since i ordered them on cyber monday and they've been just sitting in the corner wanting to be played with so i kind of stuffed everything in the box it's an next box and hopefully the background lighting and everything is okay i kind of switched my chair around a little bit so you guys don't get so much of the wiry kind of background so i'm just going to kind of dive right in and share everything with you guys so here's the box I'm going to start off with the Sephora products that I ordered um, and then a kind of random matte product. So the first thing I'm going to share with you guys is the NARS Pure Radiant Tinted Moisturizer. I did a review kind of slash demo on this. I had a pretty decent sample size. I used it for a few days and I really liked it. So I picked up the color St. Moritz, which is, which is a medium one. I'm sorry if you can hear people in the background. I have um, children over at my house. So that is what it looks like. And it's just in the basic NARS um, packaging. It's kind of a squeezy tube. I really like this because it's really natural looking and it's really, um, it just kind of adds coverage but not too much coverage. I like this a lot for everyday wear. Um, and then actually another product I'm going to share with you guys. I already put it on my Instagram, but I might as well include this because it's what I'm wearing. Um, I also got a sample size from Sephora at the same time I got the NARS sample. I got a sample size of the Bare Minerals Bare Skin Foundation. And so I really, really like this and I also bought it. Um, but I did buy this for my work because we don't carry NARS, but we carry Bare Minerals. So this is what I have on my face right now. So just throwing that in there. But I didn't order, order that online. Everything I'm showing you here, I ordered pretty much online. Um, and then with that, I needed an additional $10 to get my cart for free shipping. So I just picked up the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. And hopefully these lights aren't totally terrible. Uh, so these are the two products that I picked up from Sephora. And then I did get a few sample sizes of some perfumes. But I have them kind of put away somewhere and I just forgot to grab them. It's okay. So next is the MAC Stroke Cream. The next product I have is the MAC Strobe Cream. I got it in the kind of travel size. I'm really not sure what to do with this. I know a lot of people put it on as a moisturizer before their foundation. Um, I also have heard that a lot of people mix it with their foundation and it kind of gives it a dewy finish. So let me know what you guys use this for. I think I used it once, um, but then I just kind of set it aside. I wanted to see what your guys' thoughts were on this product and how you use it. So please feel free to let me know. I feel really out of the loop. I haven't filmed in a while, so. And everything else is from NYX, which is why it's all packaged in this cute little box. So these are all the NYX products I got. Um, I purchased this on the Cyber Monday sale. They were having 40% off, so I kind of went a little crazy, but that's okay. I already took off the sales of everything, so I wasn't sitting here struggling time trying to take the sales off of everything. So I got, I think, like 12 products, and then they threw in um something for free i believe because i didn't order it but it came in with my shipment so i'm going to start off with the lip and eye products so the first two products are going to be my nyx wonder pencil and light if you guys already watch my videos or follow me on instagram this is my holy grail eyeliner i actually already have one more that's brand new that i bought forever ago um but i figured since they were having this sale i would stock up on these i use this every single day in my waterline obsessed with that stuff so and I have it sealed because I don't want to open them and have them dry out because I probably won't use those for a while so I'm not going to show you swatches for those it's a little unnecessary um so I have three lip liners I'm sorry that's coming out um the first one I didn't order they kind of just threw it in for me so which one is it three Nick. Well, they're all mixed, but the first one is 814 Rose Brown, and it's just a kind of darker brown, almost like a chocolate brown. 
Um, I'm not really sure if I would use that, but I guess it's a nice option to have. So, and it was free. I didn't pay for it. Um, I think they kind of threw that in as like an extra for these sales. So the two that I purchased were number 830 Current or Raisin. It says both. I'm not sure which one it is. And 838 Purple Rain. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch Current. It's a really, really dark purple, which I was super excited to order. And then Purple Rain is such a beautiful color. So, okay. So the first one right here. That one is in purple rain and the middle one is current you can see it's a darker purple sorry i don't know why the light is turning yellow sorry about the lighting it kind of sh shifts when i do close-up swatches um but i'll probably most likely do swatches on my instagram after i do upload the entire video so you guys can get a better idea um so next three lip products were the nyx butter glosses i think i already have four or five of them. I'm really freaking obsessed with these. They're amazing. So I purchased vanilla cream pie, sugar cookie, and maple blonde. So let me see. This one is vanilla cream pie. It's just a light pink sugar cookie, which I'm most excited about. It's kind of a um, violet -y pink. It looks really pink on camera, but it's more of like a violet pink. And then maple blondie, which is kind of a peachy color. So let me go ahead and do close-ups of these. Hopefully my lighting doesn't switch around. I really wish it didn't do that. So those are the three. So, so pretty. If you haven't tried these lip glosses, I highly recommend them. They're so smooth. Um, the exact name totally says it all. Butter gloss, they're so buttery. They're not sticky at all. And let's see. I'm just gonna kind of do some swatches here for you guys and then again I will do swatches on my Instagram just so you can get a super clear view because it doesn't do it justice with my lighting so the three are right here I love their butter glosses I have about five products left so four of these are blushes so two of them are just the regular powder blushes the first one I picked up is in the shade Terracotta. A lot of people rave about this shade. It's just kind of a nice neutral brown with a gold shimmer in it. I think this would be pretty for everyday look. So that is Terracotta. Next is in the shade Summer Peach. I love that name. This shade is so beautiful. It's just a really nice warm. I don't know if peach would be the right word to describe this. It looks a little faded on camera, but I think it's a little bit writer in real life so that one is summer peach so pretty and then the other two i purchased were the rouge cream blushes the first one i picked up is in the shade natural which pretty much speaks for itself i've been kind of obsessed with cream blushes lately so that is what that looks like it's just a really gorgeous everyday color you can see that of course the one day that i can film it's so loud sorry and the next shade is in the shade Glow, and that is what that looks like. So, so pretty. Um, I haven't tried any of their cream blushes, but again, I've been super obsessed with cream, cream blushes lately, so I'm super pumped to try that. And last product I picked up was a bronzer, and this is the NYX Matte Bronzer, and this is in the shade Deep. I like to use darker bronzers for contouring. I have a lot of them, but... I wanted to try this one. I already kind of swatched it when I first got it, but I haven't actually tried it on my cheeks yet. So I think, there we go. I think this is gonna be really, really perfect for my skin tone for contouring in the cheekbones, my nose, my forehead. So excited to try that. So that is my nice little haul for you guys. I think I got a good amount of products, so I'm super pumped and excited to try everything. And I'm super, super excited. So today is the 28th, I believe, a few days after Christmas when I'm filming this. And I'm going to a concert, one of my Christmas presents. I'm going to go see Sublime at the House of Blues. Um, so I just really wanted to try and do this for you guys. I'm sorry again for the background noise. The one day that I was finally, finally had time to film and it was just so loud. Hopefully you didn't hear too much of that. But anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.